Silent Hill, the short message. <laughs> I have zero expectations for this, by the way. I'm expecting it to be bad, all right? I'm not a lunatic. It's a Konami game. You know, the, the previous... Okay. This title contains depictions of suicide, self-harm, abuse, trauma, and bullying. We love that stuff. Okay. All right. It sounds like a song from... Ah, oh, which Silent Hill is it? It's it's got the it's got the same vibes of of an exact Silent Hill song. I just can't remember what it is. I think it's I think it is Origins. I'm not sure. Good song though. Good music. So far so good. All right, if you feel that you're at risk of suicides or self-harm, please seek medical and or professional advice, treatment and or support from experts in the field of suicide and self-harm prevention. If you need immediate assistance, please. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. Mm -hmm. There's no beauty in living like that. I want to be strong on my own without a group. If there were only someone who would understand that to adult me. Is it quiet here? I'll turn it up. Silent Hilling. So I wonder if this will have any connection to Silent Hill whatsoever. But wasn't I just I wanna show you something. Can you come to the villa? Maya. Oh yeah. Maya told me to Maya. come here. It sounds like Rose's voice actress from uh Brazil Village. Doesn't it? Am I crazy? <gasps> you suck, it says right there. No, you don't. This model. Is it this building? Okay. The plan to rebuild Kettenstadt. <laughs> An overview. <clears throat> is a town with a long history as a thriving border stronghold. In recent years, those in their 20s have begun leave leaving en masse, causing concern. The aim of this wide-scale project is to rebuild and restore it to its former glory to, with the help of the Chinese investment firms. The theme is revitalization. The abandoned properties developed by Japanese corporations in 2008 have long been a problem, but repurposing, that, repurposing them, we could cut costs substantially and better realize our vision for a new <laughs> Kettenstedt. Kettenstedt. You know, I just gotta, I just gotta leap right into it. Kettenstedt. Wow. So this place didn't always suck. 
Our parents dreamed of this? It's Italian, okay. Well, yeah, okay. Now, don't let me catch you guys trying to pronounce Canadian words, all right? Then we'll see who's laughing. Uh-oh, it's back. Plans to rebuild Ketten startled. Okay, you know what? We're gonna call it Ketten. Have suffered yet another major setback as instability caused by the COVID-19 pandemic has reduced interest from foreign investors. What's COVID-19? Uh, previous plans to jumpstart the town failed to materialize owing to the monetary instability caused by the 2008 global financial crisis, which I can see chat moving very fast. I don't know what you guys are talking about, uh, which forced the plan to involve Japanese corporations and financial institutions to be reconsidered. Two attempts to rebuild, two failures. Due to unfortunate external circumstances, Ketten has struggled to bounce back with the increased unemployment. The city council is considering ways to revitalize the economy by drawing skilled experts to the area, but as of yet, no effective measures have been implemented. Kettenstadt. Everyone's losing their futures. That's all adults are. A slave to the system. True. Where are you, Maya? True. Okay, listen, I'm not trying to start shit, but I'm just saying. You might see a word called woke appear many times in the comments um, of YouTube, Twitch, and Twitter. Um, I don't know what it means, but you may see it a lot for this game. Notice of provisional meeting to all Villa residents. We have received many inquiries about the management of this building after the recent news. We would therefore like to hold a meeting to explain our policies more formally. We hope you could find the time to attend. Yeah, I woke up late today too. Oh, a baby. Huh. Hey, baby. Roses. Really smell like poo poo poo. No ex. I'm trapped. Oh, please tell me we can pick this up. I've always been trapped. Hey, that's like a Silent Hill map, except we can't pick it up. Feels bad, man. If we picked up that map and it was. Wait, take a photo with my phone! You guys are right! I can only use my phone for. I'm press I'm gonna press every button and see what happens. Um alright, you can't do anything except walk. A and zoom. Alright. The touchpad? Oh, yeah, touchpad. Sorry if I woke you up. Didn't see you at your job yesterday. Still not feeling good? Chat. Okay. Maya? Maya. I can't wait to see how this is related to Silent Hill. For a graffiti artist, spray paint and a blank wall are all you need. In Ketten, the walls of a particular apartment building are the canvas for several artists, with a new piece showing up every day. Social media star Bok Ba Soup features her work here. Given her passion for flowers, it's only fitting that her name is Bok Ba Soup, which is short for cherry blossom. Bok Ba's art continues to captivate the hearts of the young, so we reached out for, to her for comment. Keeping her eyes fixed on her new piece, she had this to say. All I'm doing is showing what these girls feel on the inside, but can't show on the outside. If any of them connect with a girl in the art, it's probably because they're experiencing the same thing. Okay. CB added that the flowers she depicts on the young girls she paints bloom out of their scars, out of the scars they bear. That's funny that this is mentioned because all the art for uh, Silent Hill F is like flowers coming out of people. So maybe that's a connection. Um, the flowers represent the girls overcoming past traumas or at least their desire to do so. 
everyone can see how talented she is. I couldn't be more different. Oh, here it is. Did Maya do this? CB. Cherry Blossom. That's Maya's signature. She's... amazing. Whoa. The city's a blank canvas. Begging for us to paint it with our hopes and dreams. I want to show the hidden side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. Yeah, it sounds exactly like Rose. I like this live action connection. FMV game. What are you hiding inside? Um... Don't worry about what people think. Be proud. I put yogurt in my chili earlier. How could I ever be proud of myself? By the way, I'm digging this so far. I just hope it ties into Silent Hill somehow. Because why I say that is I feel like Silent Hill is just a name that Konami is going to use now. Because Ascension has no tie to Silent Hill. So it'd be funny if every single Silent Hill game from this point forward just does nothing to do with anything. You know what I mean? It's just a, a brand at this point, but we'll see. Well, Resi no, re not like Resident Evil at all. Resident Evil ties everything back to, back to the roots. Every single Resident Evil game does. Like Tom Clancy, there we go. That baby's head fell off. Hello! Who's there? Uh oh. Oh, my, my phone, my, or my, my, the thing, the controller's making noise. Sorry for the late reply, I fell asleep. Don't worry about it, how you feeling? I'm okay. I can actually kind of get some rest now. Didn't mean to scare you or anything. Oh, I don't get scared. <sighs> That's a relief. He woke up. Yeah. Come on, Konami. Are these things that people said about me oh, uh, growing up? Loser cry She's gross, stupid, ugly. Loser. Liar. Crazy. Liar. Baby. Dumb. I hate you. It's 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 Star Wars episode 3 quotes. Never said anything nice. Liar. I hate you. Uh, child abuse slash neglect in Ketten. A, re a recent statistical survey has shown the rate of child abuse in Ketten last year was nearly double that of the average in other developed nations in Europe. The recent is this a real place, by the way? The recent economic strife, or is there any place called this? Um, and its resulting poverty are thought to be the cause. Like, is there an inspiration for this place? Or no? My mom loved me. Wait. Hervey? Slut, shut up. Dude, whoever these are about has received all. Pervert with bad handwriting. Oh, yeah, yeah. Loser, eat shit. This is like being a str this is actually like being a streamer. Like I've been called all these things over the course of nine years of streaming. See, I am, you know what's crazy? I'm so numb to the pain at this point that like, I 
the first thing I could have thought when I walked in here was like, wow, it's like being a streamer, but it took me a while. But yeah, it is like being a streamer. I've been called insane, dumb, loser. Yep. Stupid. Yeah. Cry baby. Yep. Insane. Yeah. We've been out. Creep. Yep. Um, dumb. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what else? Delusional. Weirdo. Yeah. Got that a lot. Weirdo. That's, that's a big one. That's like my, that's the biggest one. Pervy. Per pervert. Yep. Got that. Yeah. I've been called all this stuff. Then I have my trauma. Oh, well, there we go. Actually, I don't know if anyone's called me a slut. Um, but time will tell. There's there, there. See, uh, guys don't become a streamer. Antidepressants. I've taken enough medication. Fat. Remember that guy called me fat the other day? He said, I watched your clip earlier. You got fat, he said. Whoa. They have a post me slip? No, no, don't show wrist slitting. Don't show wrist slitting. That's the one thing I can't stomach. 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 That's I'm sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. Oh. Wait, she didn't do it. Thank you, Dudney. Oh, my phone rang, or my controller phone. Anita what here let me let me make sure you guys can hear it you didn't look so hot the other day I'm fine you don't have to worry about me I'm well I'm obviously gone and now that's a good friend right there I'm taking my meds meds are good but what about therapy that doesn't really do much to be honest talking to adults doesn't help some of our classmates were hospitalized you don't have to do this alone I know I'll let you know if I need anything and those guys deserved it. They feel bad, you know, all of them. Not bad enough. Maya? Maya? No. Oh. Go, 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 go! Am I getting chased? Uh... Uh... She's after us! She's coming, boys! Hurry! Where am I? Found. You here? I'm in the studio. Mm. Maya? There's a monster here. You okay? It's foggy. Teenage suicides continue at the infamous building. 
A rundown apartment complex in Kenton has become known for its suicides, with the teenage girls jumping from its roof practically every year. Despite repeat events, the building abandoned ever so oh, the building abandoned ever since the development slash management company declared bankruptcy remains easily accessible. Um, the young and unemployed are not deterred by the building's grim reputation, though with many continuing to enter it and young graffiti artists using it for their work. Meanwhile, local residents' security concerns continue to grow. Mm -hmm. Please, not Maya too. She has been acting weird lately. I don't know what that means. Oh, more art. Cherry blossoms bloom within the grasp of death. With most flowers, the rot sets in, then they fall. That's the price of new life. I honestly wonder if this is just going to lead Not right into Silent Hill F. They bloom beautiful. They fall beautiful. That's how I want my life to be. Are these FMVs dub? I assume they were recorded in Japanese and then they just threw English over it. It's a free game, so I mean. Thank you, Landa. No, guys, if, if people don't text you back instantly, then find new friends. I've had people, oh my god, I do not last long with people like that, holy shit. Like, sometimes I don't talk to my best friends for like, literally months. So, there's there's often times where I'll meet someone like on Twitch, or, or like another stream or whatever, I'll make a new friend on the internet, and then uh, we'll be friends for like a week before they're like, YOU DIDN'T TEXT ME BACK WITHIN A DAY! I'm just like, bro, I'm fucking busy. And what the hell do you want to talk about? Your toenails? Like, get off my back. It's gone, right? Where is the studio? By the way, I'm, I'm, and I'm, when they say stuff like that, I'm fine staying friends. It's just they, some people just can't do that. And that's fine. Everyone to each their own. I don't judge people, like, if you want to, yeah, do whatever the fuck you want to do. Just don't get mad at the people doing whatever the fuck they want to do. You know what I mean? One sec, let's go this way. Okay, I don't know why I said toenails. No one's ever talked with their toenails with me. <laughs> let's try to think of something disgusting. <laughs> Alright, let's go outside. Trash room. There's actually bodies there? Oh no, it's it's a bunch of flowers and stuff, I see. That's nuts.
Yeah, I like the like this is good so far. Why I mentioned the woke thing earlier, by the way, guys. Um people are just gonna hate this game right off the bat, trust me. I've been on the internet a while. Ten minutes in, people are gonna turn this game off. Um, because it's just has the vibes to it. But as women. And just before we go further, um, uh, I have had friends that have went down this kind of path. I've also, uh, fallen into this kind of path, not with hard drugs or anything, but, um, so this is, you know, I, I can relate. Remember earlier we talked about relating like God of War Ragnarok. If you have a kid, you're going to relate harder. Uh, Silent Hill 2, if your wife died, d just died, nothing more than that. You're going to relate harder, you know, stuff like that. So, you know, I can, I can vibe with this game a little. Phone's ringing. Oh, her again. By the way, thought any more about college? Can't do it. That a girl. You don't have to decide right away. So, once you're at cottage, uh, co college, are you not coming back here? Coming. No way. I'll come back occasionally. My parents would give me shit if I didn't come home for breaks. But yeah, just give college some more thought, okay? I told you I can't go. It's not for me. Studying ain't my thing. I told you I would help you. It's fine. I can't do anything. Don't know what I'd do if I got in. Be proud of who you are. Wait, what about those drawings you showed me? You could audit an art class. It could lead to a job. Uh-oh. Emily doesn't get it. Doesn't get it. Gotcha. So he don't really like this place. I get it. People in this town see graffiti as nothing but trashy doodles. And my classmates talk about me. Might not be a bad idea to leave town, actually. The great thing about graffiti is, the world's your canvas. And as long as I'm with you, I can have fun anywhere. Okay. There's no way out. Graphics in 50 years. CB? Are these Maya's sketches? These aren't even finished. And they look this good. They seem happy. A new life. So full of life. Who's the... Maya? Who's the bro? Where are you? My German is lacking. All right. My, my. Okay, don't bust it. No, uh, let me try it for real. Why won't she reply? Where are you? Skizin. Skizin boo. Am I going crazy? See, did I do it? It's all a streamer thing, okay? Now, let me, don't make me pull you guys aside out of class right now. Pick pick an individual chatter, call them on Discord, and get you to, to pronounce some French things, all right? Who did 
us. Me. Did you post this too? <sighs> Even more followers. Thirty seven thousand. Two one oh two. This is this is the life, look. Some new followers here. Oh yeah, yeah. I need to play games like this. Yeah. Sexy. Boom. Loving it. <laughs> yeah, ladies. Stop with the boring photos already. Oh shit. No sexy stuff. No followers. Yeah. Shit. Wow. You hate your followers. I got that one. Oh, I Congrats typed in his chat on once, the fucking comment goal. went ZOOM! Come and I'm on. mad because he didn't he respond to it. Already. Stop! Please! Oh my god. People, I only have two eyes, and usually they're here, at the game. Now, usually they're at the chat, and that is a bad thing. We're getting a call. It's the, it's the bad girl. Guys, that's my spec social. Bad. Make sure to follow me on social media. Thanks, Anita. Um, or I'm gonna end the stream and actually look at the stats and then. I guess I haven't accepted Maya's death yet. Maya's death. Huh? Why did she jump from the villa? Why did she have to die? Maya's dead. Thank Wait. you, Leanda. Sir? Maya's really dead? Uh, how? How could I forget that? Are you alright, Anita? Hello? Hello? Then in cutscenes? Oh yeah, I, I know that in the gameplay. Find it. Find it. Ooh. Find it. Excuse me, boo. I gotta go after this game. Wait, uh, my move speed increased. Go! It's that thing. I don't know what's happening, but I'm holding in forward. Shoot! Shoot! What the hell's going on? Okay, we need to. S oh, never mind. Oh, are we gonna jump? This 
this or I jumped from. Maybe I can be like her. So I think this. Here goes. Is it over? Huh? Okay, maybe not. Am I back at the villa? So, just, just. But why didn't I die? Something about this game I just can't uh, hold back is that Silent Hill has usually been all about breaking the mold of the good games at least. This um, this is just true. This game is with its storytelling and like what's happening is so 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 generic. You find it? Can't leave till you find it. It's not like it has nothing to do with woke wokeness or anything like that. It's just this has been done like this has been done like in like 50 freaking Korean horror movies and like it's just been and, and American. It's been done like uh, so many times. It's crazy that they went with this idea because um, it's just been done so many times. That's all. Can't leave till you find who the fuck is this? We can't we can't leave till we find it. Let's go. Let's find what the it. Fuck? But yeah, I'm I'm just saying that right now, you know, the game is not over, so. All right, we're back. Look, it's like PT oh, almost. My battery. Guys, we like PT, right? Well, yeah, what if what if this leads to the demo for Silent Hill 2 remake? That's what we got to find. Ooh. I do like the atmosphere and a lot of the quiet music. Bad girl gets an empty plate. I guess that's our mom. Because earlier when she was looking at the notes, she was like, my mom loved me, but she said it. she was like very restrained when she was saying it as if like, right? She loved me, right? So, okay, let me take a stab at what's going to happen. Alright, so the first life, we showed that she's just never good enough. Like, someone's always better than her, so she doesn't have enough faith in herself to actually achieve the things she can achieve. Like a lot of people, they go through life and they see people doing great things like, I want to do those things, but they never take the, they never go do those things even though they can. And we're, that is what we're learning with this girl. It's like, she's, oh, she's never good enough. And look at how good her friend is, her best friend, even though she does the same stuff and she could probably do those things if she worked hard enough, but she chooses to look at this person as if she can't achieve that. And now, now that we died and we're back, now we are going to see the other bad thing in her life, which is how her mom treated her. And then we're going to die again. And then we're going to see the third big thing, like why, why another big reason why her life sucks. Sorry, I'm just explaining the game for those who don't understand it. Bad girl gets an empty plate. Yeah, we shall see. Oh! 
It's all your fault, loser. Uh, what? Who would do this? What are we trying to find? I have no clue. This is honestly better than most. <laughs> it's funny the leaks are actually true. I was saying that when they dropped this uh, during the state of play. Because <clears throat> leaks for this dropped like, what was it, a year ago, two years ago? I still remember all the pictures. Um, But this is a lot better than a lot of like indie horror games on Steam. And it's free, so. Wait. It's back on. Uh, how could somebody do this? Oh, you're so full. Panda Punch! Death Mass! Your art sucks. Some people really have nothing better to do. Shadow Worm. Wait. I bet it was these. Shadow guys. Worm. Holy shit! I think I pulled a neck muscle, boys. Look, this is this is this is when you guys make fun of me. See? Oh, uh, I post like a picture on Twitter, like, oh hey, hey guys, going live soon. Gonna be playing Pal World. Oh, what the fuck is Resident Evil? Oh, nice picture. Oh, nice hairline. Oh, you got fat. Uh, uh, can you give me a recipe for fuck you, Buck? Oh, text, text. This is thank you, just Dirk. Like before. Uh, you feeling okay? Good enough to get out of bed? Hey, sorry for being a bad friend. There it is! So is Maya really dead? Why are you asking that? Uh-oh. What's going on here? Things are getting trippy now. Oh, she seemed perfectly fine before it happened. So she's really dead then, yeah? You okay? You getting sleep? Answer the question! But what about their shut? Okay, broken record, you're lady. So good to me, no, no, she's not. You're leaving me behind. No, all she talked about was a book she read recently. Still, <gasps> the film Absolute Demon. There's a there's an episode of a Masters of Horror is what it's called. There's an episode of that with um, Norman Reedus. That's the it's the book version of that film. Did Maya really not say? The film absolute them all. Like, at all? Cigarette so burns. What did you think of the book? The author killed themselves when they were young. Something beautiful from something tragic. It's kind of enchanting, isn't it? No. I wonder what they were thinking. Right before they died. Anyway. Anyway. I didn't think you'd share your thoughts in the last Anyway! Time. What do you, you mean, really anyway? Shy, aren't you? I actually kind of like that, though. You just said you're gonna. You're interested in. You write that! In a really flowery and passionate way. Flowery. The, the, the art is about her. Bro? I can't wait to read more. So, all right. So when I said the film absolute them all perfectly, the French film, no one says shit in the chat. Oh, but when I struggle to say a German word, when the hell am I going to learn German? Okay. Oh, I get ridiculed to hell. Letters. 
this is what it's like. See, the game ain't so funny anymore, is it? Now that I'm, look, see? Yeah, it's not so, it's not so funny. Yeah. See, these are true things that I go through, but the difference is I don't give a, a fuck. Um, it doesn't bother me because I've had stone scan ever since college. But um, it's true though. It's true. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's true though. All right. This is all your fault. Everything. You're a heartless bitch. You stole my only friend, my place in this world, all of it. And you don't even care. I'm invisible to you. I fucking hate you. You're not talented. You're not special. You call those shit stains art? You came out of nowhere and ruined everything. Fuck off. Okay. Get the fuck out of my life, you piece of shit freak. <clears throat> you know, that reminds me. I've seen my neighbor like 10 times in the past 10 days on my... In, on my ring, my ring camera. It's just standing there for minutes waiting for me to answer, but I'm in the middle of a stream and I've just pictured him. Imagine if he was standing there tonight and I'm like, oh, you fucking, you ruined everything. <laughs> He's like, wait for me to answer the door. Oh, shit, dude. Uh, one day I'll get to, uh, one day I'll get, I'll get to it. Uh, founded in 1709, DMU is one of Europe's oldest and most revered institutions. Its state-of-the-art research facilities eagerly await your arrival. Orientation details. When? September 24th, 2021. Where? School of Medicine Central Lecture Hall. Please wear a mask when attending. This is for the college. Oh yeah, I forgot this game mentioned COVID-19. Telephone! Hey, Anita, you got a minute to talk? Bro, get off my back. You seemed kind of... Before, it was like five minutes ago. Just before! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Solid old two reference. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> We should go shopping together somewhere. I haven't left my house in what feels like forever. Plus, my brother's coming here. Just before! Yeah, just gonna try to avoid him as much as possible. So, shopping. Yeah, we can find you something cute. Okay. Now nah, I'm good. Not a fan of crowds. And nothing looks cute. Okay. Stop talking like that. You're way too hard on yourself. You've got the looks. You just need to find the right outfit. Too hard on myself, huh? Amelie's the only one who thinks that. Oh god, this looks like Jeff the Killer. <clears throat> I haven't been able to study since my brother came back for Christmas break. He's nice and doesn't interrupt my studies or anything, but I can't stand him staring at me. I know he was probably just messing with me back then, but I've got- I've been scared of him ever since. It made me hate any guy looking at me. I can't believe other girls walk around school and town showing so much skin. February 21st. I think I'm finally finding my study groove. My test scores are really good. I'm worried about how much my parents are fighting recently, though. They were yelling at each other again today. I asked my mom why, but she wouldn't say. This is it. Test day tomorrow. Mom told me I should be proud of myself since I work so hard, so I'm feeling great. She's not my real mom, but I know she loves me and I love her. Mom, I'm gonna ace this test tomorrow for both you and Dad. Who is this pie? So, do you guys know Jeff the Killer? I think my first traumatizing, not even kidding, so d don't start with the, oh, you're glorifying trauma. If you laugh at this story, you factually are glorifying trauma. You're finding it funny. So, yeah, how about reverse Uno? One time. I was baked out of my mind the night before and I drank too. So I woke up like really, I slept for like two hours. I woke up, I was like still sort of stoned and sort of tipsy. I went on my computer, pitch black in my computer room. Oh, and they're already laughing. 
pitch black in my computer room, okay? I go on Facebook and I click on this picture. I'm just looking through this picture. I forget whose picture it was or whatever, but I'm scrolling through the comments and someone put like, oh, Nicki Minaj, hilarious thing. And there was a link. I clicked the link, okay? And it was this, it was Jeff the Killer's face like this. Extremely huge and blown out and just flashing lights and like it was a screamer. So you know what a screamer is. And just super loud volume, like ah, oh, just like a woman screeching at the top of her lungs and just flashing scream with Jeff the Killer's face. Seriously? You guys saw that too? Some of you seen that? Uh, shivers down my fucking spine, man. My headphones were cranked. It was like, it was like four in the morning, five in the morning. I was like out of it. I was just like cruising Facebook, just chilling. And I swear, been looking over my shoulder ever since. Not even kidding. Scared, scared me senseless. Got him. Yeah, I got got. I got got real good. <sighs> Well, I'm glad there's people on the internet that can relate with that story, because Jay, Jay, October 17th, night. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. I finally focused on my studies, so I think I might pull an all-nighter. Hey, I've been there. It won't be good for my skin. Okay. I could hear people calling me troll, nerd, but I don't care. I have to make it to college in the city. Mom and dad are counting on me to do well. I'll make them proud by getting my first into my first choice. So I assume this is the brother. Um, uh, let's see. All right. Time to hit the books till morning. Dad was talking today about how there was a plan to rebuild the town. They were going to use a bunch of funding from China to turn the town into something better, but everything got canceled due to COVID. Sure. It would have been nice if it had gone through, but I just couldn't see it happen. Even if things had worked out, not in this place. It hasn't been special since I was little. There's nothing to do. The buildings are ancient. It's a dump. My future isn't here. It's in the city where the college life is waiting for me. Everything's riding on my entrance exam next year. I have to get there before my brother comes. Oh, it's her again. I'm just in a different room. Okay. Mentioning COVID in a video game gets like 10% of your audience, if not more, to hate that game. I find that funny because I don't like it's a thing. Get used to it, but. It is funny though. Stay home alone. Stay home alone. Whoa! Why? Their brain brain don't work so well, I think. Well, we can relate it to trauma actually. COVID is a trigger word for some people. But just the mention of it, not that anyone in their family or them went through any like major sickness or anything. It's just a trauma word for them because their brain brain don't work so, so well. August 24th, 2021. Uh-oh. Big year. Um, COVID, yeah, it's a jump scare to some people. Uh, okay. Thank you, Hot Taggy ta Taco, for the raid and the resub. Thank you. All right, August 24th. This is a great stream game, I gotta say. Um, I got some materials for my first choice in the mail today. I'm gonna be a college freshman. I'm so happy. I still can't believe it. Mom, dad, I'm going to study my arse off. Don't, so, don't wanna swear. And be the best daughter ever. Thank you so much for everything. Mom and dad are yelling at each other. They're talking about bankruptcy. Wasn't everything supposed to work out even without rebuilding that rebuilding plan? So this means they're out of money, right? Does this mean I can't go to college? All that hard work was for nothing. No way. Don't leave me, mom. I can't stay here. I can't be stuck here with my brother. Mom just left. She told me to get out of the way. I have to get out of here. I want to disappear, but where would I go? This is all a bad dream. Oh. So wait, August and then September. And then mom just pieces. Brutal. Amelie hated the way her brother looked at her. Oh yeah, this is Amelie. I bet she wants to leave to get away from all that. Yeah, okay, we're learning about her. Damn. So she had it rough too. I 
I don't know where I'd be without my mom. Holy shit. When I was trying to become a streamer, I, I had this like two year period where I was like conflicted between quitting my chef job and, and pursuing streaming. And my mom was like, no, no, you, no, you can't quit your chef job. Then finally one day, finally one day, all it took was a major, um, a major breakdown for me being too stressed out working 80 hours a week. And she let me quit and still live at, at home. Um, September 25th, 2021, at around 10 a.m. on the 24th, a local resident reported seeing an 18-year-old female high school student fall from the roof of the Ketton apartment building. The girl was rushed to the hospital but was pronounced dead two hours later. According to school staff, the girl was distraught over not being able to attend college due to troubles at home. No note or diary was found, but police still believe her death may be a suicide. So this September 25th. So is this supposed to be Emily's not like this though? Right? Amelie? See, okay, we had a we had this discussion earlier about like relating to a game. Um Okay, me me even mentioning this killed chat, so I'm gonna just not even mention it. <laughs> Alright, Jeff the Killer, let's get out of here. You know, I'm actually enjoying the game now. The story is pretty enticing. School. School. It's Outlast too. I don't think the story is awful. It's just really, it's just generic. Okay, you guys make fun of me. Oh, your German's good, Bach. What's okay? What's what's EU sixty three? Come on. You have 10 seconds because there's five second chat delay. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wow! My chat! Europium. Can we get a fact check on that? Because I also don't know the answer. <laughs> Those weren't seconds. That was close enough. Oh, oh. Wait. Chemist here, detox. <clears throat> Stop. Sorry. Ah. Uh, yeah, stubborn honey. It's not. It can be pretty stressful. I wasn't working eighty hours a week. I was working like 60, 70. I think where where I went overboard, where like right before the crumble of my culinary career, or not crumble, when I chose to actually finally quit and my mom supported me. Um, by the way, when I lived with my mom, I still had to pay rent, so it wasn't wasn't all fucking flowers, all right. Um, uh, I just got I just got sleeping pills for the first time in my life. You know, because we're going through such a traumatic based game, I'll share all my trauma. Um, because just to let you guys know, you're not alone. You look, people look at streamers like this fucking iron. Oh, they've never been through anything in their life. Everything's just handed to them on the silver platter. Not me, Buster Brown, not me. Anyway, um, I got sleepy pills prescribed for the first time in my life because I was working um, every weekend. I worked two 12 hour shifts back to back. So I'd work five to five and then five to five. So every uh, Friday and Saturday. So um, I could never sleep before it because I'd stay up till five. So I'd stay up till five and then I'd have to go to work. So anyways, I, like I couldn't sleep. I, I, had, I had heavy insomnia back then. So anyways, one time um, we got the pills and I took the pills 
I was so nervous about it too. I hate drugs. I fucking hate drugs so much. I never ever wanted to take drugs, but it came to that. It finally came to that. I was like, fine. I cracked. I'm like, I'll just go get some sleeping pills because I just had insomnia for so long. Like you guys, a lot of you don't know what it's like to sleep one hour a day and then work an eight hour shift and then sleep one hour, then work eight hours, sleep one hour, work eight hours and do that for months in a row. And every single solitary day, you only sleep one hour. I went through that for months. Anyway. Um, so, but I got baked. Uh, weed doesn't count, boys. Weed doesn't count. Weed or alcohol? Out, out. Okay. But everything else I hate. Everything else. Even, at, even there was a time I went months without taking Advil, even if I got sick. I just didn't want to take any drugs. Anyway, I took the sleeping pills. And I swear, I didn't sleep a fucking wink, dude. I was laying down. I'm like, all right, yes, sleeping pills. This is going to be, so I was so pumped, dude. I was like, so I was, took the pill, like, fuck yeah. Down the hatch, let's go. Eight hours sleep. Head at the pillow, hour went by. I'm just like, all right, takes a little kick in, sure. Two hours went by, heart starts pounding like crazy. Eight hours goes by. My shift starts in minutes. My heart's just fucking pounding. I've been laying in bed for six hours straight. My heart's just going like crazy. I'm sitting there trying to sleep. It's not happening. Like, fall asleep during a marathon run. Tell me how that goes. I woke up, I was in tears. I went up to my mom like, I cannot go to work. To like, I can't, I can't, I can't do it. And she's freaking out like, you know, you're gonna get fired or whatever. Cause like this shit, the culinary industry is very intense. Um, and I'm just like, I can't, I can't, I can't. Like, I'm literally still high from the drug. I ended up working that day, by the way. Um, and um, yeah, weeks later, I just, you know, I broke down. I'm like, I can't do this anymore. And then I became a streamer. Well, I didn't become a streamer. I was already a streamer for like a year, but then I started full-time streaming because full-time streaming didn't require a schedule. So I could sleep eight hours and still be a streamer. Thank you, chat. Thank you for being my enablers. Dumb. Ah! Oh, this is also chat, by the way. Look, here, this is what being a streamer is like. Every single day I go through this. Go away! Change the game! Freak, no wonder nobody likes you on YouTube, they say. <laughs> Excuse me, boys. I'll laugh it up. Actually, you know what? This is a good day. This is a good day. This is easy. Um, Witch? Okay, I've never been called a witch, I don't think. So, are you guys going to brush the garbage off my chair? Or what's... Oh. No? Aha. Witch's locker. Guess that's me. Get out, you freak! Slut! Your art's fucking you a freak! Cocky piece of shit! Cocky? Dude, why do people call like innocent women sluts? And why do people This girl's cocky? This girl ain't cocky. Yes, it's exactly like being a streamer. Crazy! Yeah, thank you. Shut your whore mouth! Yeah, thank you for the resub. Ugly. <clears throat> Thanks for the follow. Get out, you freak! Yeah, I'm working on it. Pretty shitty school. <laughs> yeah. Guys, I can't imagine what school's like nowadays. Maya's not a freak. Oh, Maya. My oh, so they're calling Maya slut and Maya like cocky and stuff. I see. Just because she looks good and she's good at what she does. And again, it's high school, so everyone's jealous, so they just tear into her. Classic high school. Oh, 
Hello? I want to see what happens when you get caught by the thing. There better not be an achievement for beating the game without dying. Alright, let's see what happens. It's probably not going to be bad. I was getting ready to fake scream, but nothing scary happened. Oh, thank God. I thought something scary was about to happen. I thought we got teleported to the start of the chapter. I was about to freak out. Why are you chasing me? Okay, cut the... You kill my bit right here, lady. Look at all these eyes. Look, it's like streaming. Look at all these eyes. That's how many eyes are watching me right now. Look, look, that's you guys. That's you guys. Oh my God. It's you guys. Look. Oh, shoot. Stop. <clears throat> yeah, she's, she's, oh, she's still uh, following us. The bullies! She might cut me off here. The dodge! Guys, welcome to Silent Hill 2024, baby. If we weren't playing a brand new Silent Hill game, I would think I, I would be thinking to myself, did I already play this before? I'm pretty sure there's a Why there's a game that has that exact scene with the eyes and everything. We played it like a few years ago. Not again. Not again. What did I do to deserve this? Maybe it was Visage. <laughs> Observer PT. Yeah, well, case in point, many games have done that, I guess. Um, find it. Find what? Find it! Just tell me what I'm looking for. Find it. Oh, what the fuck am I supposed to find? Wait, that's me. Find it. Scoosh it. Skisenba. Uh, wait. Find it. Girl in this picture is Amelie. Amelie? Wait, is this supposed to be me? No. This guy looks familiar. They're hurt. Where are you going? <sighs> yeah, that's right. Amelie. <sighs> yeah. Hmm? What's that? Oh, you like what you see? Come closer then. Wozers. Wait a sec. You two are from my class. Those glasses look good on you. Sorry, she's so cute. She's nice. I couldn't help myself. Is that supposed to be us? You're free to stop by any time. She's... You're always welcome. <laughs> oh, 
Maya only ever cared about Amelie. Oh, it's not us. I was gonna say. No, it's the opposite. It's the opposite. Where are those little dinosaurs it showed? Pregnancy test? Positive. Yipes. All I said was yipes, and you guys don't even know what that means. January 31st. I haven't been in a good mood since this morning. I tried to lose myself in my graffiti, but I wasn't feeling it. Maybe it's because my mom and I argued this morning. Probably not. We've clashed before. I've known for a long time we value different things. Is it because my classmates tease me? I doubt it. They don't know me. They're just taking their issues out on someone. It's gotta be because I lost that special person and the hope he gave me, right? Why do I feel like this? I've never felt like this before. Find it. Wait, is this a separate thing? Oh no. Um... Yipes. Oh shit. Follower only mode off. Uh, thank you, Mrs. Licious. Thank you for the raid. And thank you, Fox, for the resub. Thank you for the 96 months as well. Welcome, everybody. We're playing the new Silent Hill. I haven't found it yet. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. I can do that too. I'm, I'm a Lime sub, but if I alt tab, the game might crash. So I would put that in the emo. Uh, I would put that emote in the chat. Thank you, Mrs. Licious. Were you, uh, uh, were you doing some of this? Yeah, we have an emote like that too, except it's a little, uh... A little... Weirder. A little cursed. Follow Mrs. Licious, guys. Follow Mrs. Lish. She is, you know, for lack of a better word, I'm gonna say it. Ugh. Epic. Oh, look at these graphics. Watch this. There's no beauty in any of this. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just thinking about something. I borrowed that book you wanted. I finished it, so it's all yours. I wrote my impressions in a letter. Read it when you get home, okay? Okay. The graphics. Shit, the graphics. Oh, I, I, where was it? I love when games add, Fuck. uh, F FMV. I am a sucker for that shit, as you guys already know, because I play it. 
Bad or good, I play most FMV games. The Witch Hunt of Ketten. In the 1930s Germany, the town of Ketten attracted wealthy entrepreneurs and enjoyed a period of economic prosperity. Now, may I say behind that success, though, was supposedly a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance and mystical powers to guide the entrepreneurs. She would come to be known as the Witch of the Far East and would be greatly respected by the German people. By the way, love Germans. However, and your food? Oh, however, in 1947, the entrepreneurs suffered a great losses. A large fire spread throughout their industrial parks, losing them the majority of their factories. The Witch of the Far East, who was hospitalized, jumped off the roof of the hospital and killed herself. The Witch had been diagnosed with an unknown illness, and many believed the fires pushed her over the edge. Some citizens, however, claimed that a witch hunt was to blame. They argued the witch's rise to prominence angered the mayor's party, who used the chaos from the fires as a cover for the murder. Um, there is no evidence to support this claim, and many now view it as a mere conspiracy theory, but the mayor's party did manage to regain influence in the town after the witch's death. Since then, citizens have started to believe any stroke of bad luck as a result of the witch's curse. A witch's curse? Is that why I saw what I did before? Oh, I, I'm not good with the years. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not good with the years. I legitimately didn't know those things lined up. And most countries have done horrific things at this point. So don't ride your high horse, you fucking weirdos. Hmm. Where's that book? I don't know what Canada's... What's can Actually, what's Canada done? They've raised the the uh, the minimum housing price to eight hundred thousand dollars. That's what they've done. All right, and probably stuff in the past that I wasn't taught in history class because I skipped it a lot. Because I don't judge people based off of their their actions hundreds of years ago. I judge them based off their actions, current actions. Find it, yeah. I gotta. We gotta find it. You know what? I bet you it's not even in here. It's locked. Oh, shit. This is what true? The eight hundred thousand dollar missed room, back room, left corner. You missed it. There it is. Looks like there's space for a book here. Oh, thanks. Wait. Wait. I think I know these. <sighs> Green egg. There it is. No way. Let's not discuss all the awful things everyone has done. Guys, this is supposed to be a happy game. Um, okay, wait, I gotta be more thorough. I'm like staring at chat. Physics. Never took that class. The English Dictionary. I should definitely read that one a bit more. Sapiens. I don't like fiction. Modern eating habits. Now that's the spice right there. They even have two of them. Uh oh. <sighs> okay, where the hell is that? We gotta get out of this library. The library does horrible things to people. All right, Ketten, the town cursed by a witch. So, okay, so, so. It is a curse. Wait, I was gonna read that. But why me? Why do I have to be cursed like this? No, I'm getting a text. I need to read that book. Find it. Oh, oh, it's just her again. Stop spamming, dude. Find what in a place like this? Yeah, I assume 
I, I don't know. I, I assume the dude that, that she got pregnant with is the brother of Amelia or whatever her name is. Uh, okay. Ketten. Town cursed by a witch. Malicious magic to blame for city slump. Uh, continues to see a rapid decline in its population. The birth rate is at a mere 0.7. Less than half of the German nation average 1.6. Miscarriages are also at 31%. More than double the average 15%. The economy is in shambles, and one, the once booming industrial city has failed to revitalize itself twice. A number of researchers studying the occult point to a witch as the cause of the economic downturn in Ketten. The witch was a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance to influence economic development in the town in the 1930s. Researchers believe she was hunted down and killed before her death. She is believed to have placed a curse on the town. Is it the town? Wait, so a witch. Okay, so is this the tie-in? That, oh, it's just like Silent Hill with the witch and the, and the curse and the, and the, um, the Aglopatus and the, uh, and the, um, the, uh, what's that triangle thing called? The withering, uh-oh, don't bring that one up. Don't bring that one up. The floros of pain and suffering. Dude, where is this book, bro? You know what history class? Okay, I didn't actually skip history. You want to know the real history class I skipped a bunch? It was called... Oh yeah, it's in her locker. It was called PEI history. I skipped that class as often as I could. My god, that class sucked ass. Oh my god, it was boring. I didn't even do my exam. I remember I w one of my friends and me were gonna... We had this whole big plan for our exam. We had to like videotape this thing, this like historic monument. And my friend's dad happened to own like a cottage out far away. And it was like near this historic landmark. And we recorded a bit of the thing, but then we actually never finished it. And then we just skipped the class on the day of the exam. I failed that class. I failed two classes in my life, political science and PEI history. Because I just it's didn't like go to them. Well, I went to political science, but I wrote Star Wars and Dragon Ball Z crossover fan fictions for every exam, and I'm not even kidding. And my 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 teacher just wrote LOL on like every test. I've never seen like that before. Like I literally legitimately got zeros. I'm not even being sarcastic or lying. Are you alright, Anita? You left me on read, so I was worried. Sorry, I was just thinking about Maya. Not sure if you know this, but Maya was bullied at school. I know. But she said she was okay. I figured I shouldn't push the issue. Then it was too late. Bonk. Why didn't she say anything before she died? I wish she had talked to me. Maybe she didn't see me as a friend. That's not true. She loved you. This short message is a lot longer than I thought it would be. Maya Slocker. Razor blades. Oh, it's not here. It wasn't here before either. Bonk. Wait, what about my locker? Oh. Uh, what? God, I'm. I was like. <laughs> I was completely missing the desk. Wait, is it not that? Can you go in third person? No. None of the buttons do anything except for this. And and I can bring up my cell phone. Alright, well it's not there either. 
Oh. Amelie there it Walker. is. Amelie had it. Yes. The plot thickens. Just a novel. Wait a sec. <sighs> Corper cream. Corper. So we're going to my locker now? Wait, is it not in there? Oh, there it is. My locker. Why is it locked? Is there something I don't want to see? Uh... There was numbers we've seen in the past. I was going to put in 1947. When was that war, by the way? I have no clue. That war, that war, he calls it. All right. You know what? I'm done talking about PEI history. Thank you, Jaluva. Um. Wait. Uh, which note could it be in? So this is my locker. And what could it be? Uh, where's that suicide? September 25th, uh, 2021. Shit. Hmm. Stuck, boys. Okay, wait, wait. There, it's, 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 I bet it's just around here. Inspecting. Liar. Liar! Oh, it's 2509. Oh, oh. Maybe. Yeah, you might be right. That's, that's a good point. Liar! Okay. Black, red, yellow, blue. No, I don't know. God, this is this is something that should be oh, okay, one. Alright, we got it. Alright. Uh okay, so one is the third one. Three. Zero. So zero, three, one. inside and I can't look away let's go here it is what's this letter was it inside the book remember when I said I wanted to live like a cherry blossom to be beautiful and dignified for a fleeting moment simply by letting go of life. Daring to bloom, knowing it won't last. And so falling in vivid color. I wish I could live like that. I want to experience true beauty, if only for a moment. I met someone who made me feel different. He 
He showed me a whole new world. Gave me hope. I honestly thought he could help me find a new me. I felt it with all my heart. But people didn't understand us. Didn't want that from us. In the end, they took my hope from me. They took him away. People... People who can't achieve beauty... ...seek comfort in others. They fear anyone different. Hate them. Try to tear them down. I can't take much more of this. I wish you and I had... I wish you and I could run away together. Wait, so... What did... Just... Me and you. Did she hide... Wait, wait. Did she hide this from Amelie? Why? She was asking Amelie for help. But... I just... to me <sighs> this is actually a very common thing with friendship cir circles was I supposed to know she'd actually kill herself <laughs> new friend gets introduced old friend is old news <laughs> forever um Classic, yeah. It's like video game. I don't want you anymore. Like that, like that Toy Story meme. I don't want to play with you anymore. I have Buzz Lightyear. Like you guys do. Like sometimes you, you leave the stream and go watch someone else. And... I'm just gonna go for a bit. In the back, baby. Let's go. Run, Skeeter, run. Find it. This is like shattered memories. Go the right way. I was listening to something. The 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 the, the controller was, was talking, dude, I swear. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Alright, so it's not that way. Catfish! <laughs> to the left, to the left! To the left! Just 
To the right, to the right. Okay, listen boys and girls, that was bologna sandwiches. I got flowered on. Okay. Alright, we got this. We got this, Skate! Can I, please don't be here, please don't, just let me, just let me go the right way right away. I'm going this way. Run! Run, little skater, run! Moldy motherfucker. Flowery motherfucker. This has been awesome guys. Thank you for choosing me to watch to play this game and instead of play it yourself or whatever. Cuz this has been honestly this has been really fun. I finally get it. I know what you want me to find. Anita, what's up? I'm so sorry, Amelie. Maya died because I killed her. What are you talking about? You and Maya wrote letters to each other, right? Yeah, but then Maya jumped off the villa roof. Well, there was supposed to be one in the last book you had, too. What? That letter. That letter was a message for you. Why are you telling me this, Anita? I was jealous of Maya. I was afraid she'd take you away from me. My mom was right. I should never have been born. Save me, flower girl. Oh. Here we go again! What? jumped off the building yeah I know I'm being like at the end of the day this is a free fucking game so oh huh? riskies even if I die this doesn't end how many times do I have to go through this Oh, 
find it. How can I get you to forgive me? Please tell me. Why won't you say anything? Find it. Do we gotta find uh, Henry's apartment? That would actually be sick. If they actually tied this in with another game, well, it's too late for that now, I think, but. Orson. Oh, Mr. Arnold. Oops. Yeah, they should. They should tie it in with Silent Hill Ascension. Yikes, dude. Yikes. February 4. I ended up heading to the roof of the villa. Couldn't help but think the girl who jumped to her death last year. Actually, a lot of girls killed themselves here. All teens, supposedly. Now the place is a famous spot for people to kill themselves. Looking down from the roof, I could see how high up I was. The thought of a light breeze sending me flying made me feel a little queasy. Were they not scared? What was going through their heads? Were they jumping away from something or to something? Yeah, I'm still interested in this. The game got a lot better from the second chapter onward. Didn't go the direction I thought it would. But I still think that unless they tie this in somehow with Silent Hill, Silent Hill does just feel like a brand at this point. It's locked. Slap the name on there and it sells. This could have been called anything, really. Silent Hill phenomena. The suicide rate has increased around the world, in large part due to the struggles brought on by COVID-19 pandemic, with countries still unsure how best to handle the issue. That was a very depressing couple of years, I gotta say. I felt very, I felt at a fucking I have definitely had my my lowest lows when I was a teenager, but definitely had a new a new adult low during that time. Uh, these trying times have also given the rise to a strange phenomena in many areas. Those affected suddenly claim to see fog, even on fair weather days, and lose consciousness shortly after. <gasps> it's the um, it's the withering. This is kind of be known as the Silent Hill phenomena. Oh, named after a similar event that occurred in a US town. The first proposed theory explaining why this could be happening is Dr. XXX, a social psychologist at XXX University, who had the following to say on the matter. To one who is psychologically unstable, fog represents uncertainty and sensory illusions. When in a state of high stress, one's vision may become obscured or tunneled, as if one is wandering through a dense fog or mist. Societal uncertainty or apprehension about the future manifests as fog, thus blurring the lines between illusion and reality. As time goes on, we are seeing more and more cases of the Silent Hill phenomena. All right. <laughs> In response, Dr. XXX calls for a rapid rebuilding of society, as well as a stronger emphasis on counseling and mental health care for the young. Dr. XXX! Silent Hill! Come on, bring on the Silent Hill XXX. All right, I'm glad that note exists. It's the Silent Hill 4 note of Silent Hill 2 equivalent. All right, Silent Hill is mentioned. The Silent Hill... F now, the world is their oyster. They gave us the, uh, like, Bioshock Infinite ending. Yeah, uh, thank you, Scott. Spoiler! No hope. I haven't even been reading the signs. No future. Are we back home? Is this my pad? This is... Wait. Me and my mom lived here. This is our living room. December 29, 2011. I've finally lost touch with him. I'll never see him again. I thought I found my happily ever after, but it was all a dream. However, I haven't lost everything. I still have my children, my cute little angels who light up my life. <gasps> I finally lost touch. Okay. 
Okay. Cute little angels. Wine for two. You know what? This gave me a traumatic flashback of... I had someone over once and we had some wine just like... It looked just like this. And you know the movie we watched? Here's the trauma part. Rob Zombie's Halloween 2. I'm sorry if that brought up... I'm sorry if that triggered anyone. Okay, let me ask the chat. Because I know my answer. Was yelling and screaming in your household a daily occurrence? Whether it was from you or your family? The ones in the chat. No, no. One, ones if yes, twos if no. Wow. Wow, you know, I never really thought about it until now. I've never really asked chat something like that. Are you guys something like this? Twos. There's so many two. Oh my god, dude. Really? My... <laughs> well, my upbringing was... <laughs> there was yelling and screaming in my house every single day. I had two older brothers, a paralyzed father, and a, a mom with like four jobs six cats two dogs i had i had hamsters i had a guinea pig fish <laughs> like it was a high stress environment um all right my new man showed up to my place today with pizza children definitely need a father but they still won't take to him he looked annoyed when he left i hope he doesn't hate me my daughter drew a picture of our family we're smiling and holding hands I wish she would have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She is slower than other kids her age. I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like that heartless bitch who raised me. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. We have a Jedi mom. Chunk. Light tuna. Captain Chunk. Yeah, I'm real short right now. Good Cola. Is that Sonic? No. Wait, am I like crouched or something? What happened? We're going back in time. March 7th, 2012. He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands from the new place he was raving about. My daughter hated the pizza, though. She's extremely picky. I should probably teach her to eat things she doesn't like. I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. True. Uh, the kids finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work, and he said he just wanted to relax. He makes me feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with them. We need him for a happy life, and I need them to realize that. I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. What the hell does that mean? Uh, and he told me the banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind. If they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with them? He doesn't visit as much as he used to. If I don't figure something out, I may never see him again. Wait, did I miss something? Maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. Like, what is that supposed to mean? 
that that she just closed them in the closet like for months like i i just assumed it was like as a timeout thing he told me banging out closet was making it hard for him to unwind if they'd just be quiet for a little bit everything would be fine what's wrong with them thank you blood rush okay i see i see i see now You know what's just dawning on me that people are going to hate about this game? That if PT was what you're most excited about? This doesn't fill that void at all. Because it's not scary. What's in the bag? It's breathing. Oh, they're all breathing. They're all moving. Yeah, it's scary in a different way, yeah. Uh, May 9th. Everything seems to be going well now that we've been going on dates. It does make you think. I think this has been a great stream just with discussion and, um, and other things. Um, because, yeah, it does really get you talking. Uh, he was worried about, or it gets me talk. Well, it gets me talking just because I've been through a lot of traumatic. Well, see, I don't. Cons I feel like if I ever went to a therapist and explained my life up to this point, I she'd be like, "Oh, so on a scale of one to ten, how stressful do you think your life is?" I'd be like, "Oh, a three. And then she'd be like, "Well, I would say you're at about a hundred, and you have very many traumatic experiences, but I just see them as nothing." But then when I say them on stream, everyone's just like, "Well, like spammy." Um, I just, to me, it's the norm. So like reading this shit is just like, you know, I've grew up, I grew up in an extremely fucked up household. I have had friends that were drug addicts, horrible drugs, some of them, and also have lost people to suicide. And also, I mean, I've lost many pets in my life too and uh, stuff, but so I've, I've been through the ringer. So stuff like this really... It's not that it flies over my head, but it's just like, <laughs> to me, I don't, I don't read like stuff about suicide and like trauma and I'm like, my God, this is horrible. I'm just like, la -dee -da, you know, yeah. What else is new? Um, everything seems to be going well now that we've been going on dates. Okay. Uh, he was worried about, so wait, what was the other year? 2011 was the year before this or in the note before this, was it like months or has it been a year? It was 2011. Oh, okay. Oh, don't feel bad for me. There's nothing to feel bad about. Never feel for me. Just hit that follow button. Thank you, Blood Rush, and thank you, Monies. Uh, he was worried. <laughs> he was worried about you guys. Worry about yourselves, and worry about this person's kids. He was worried about my kids, so he brought them a bunch of books and toys. That should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I've left the place in a bit of a mess. How old were they at this point? I should clean it, but by the time I get back, I have no energy. Oh, yeah, you can see the house get progressively shittier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Um, It started off with two wine bottles. Well, you can clearly see that this guy's not a good influence. He brought over pizza the first time. They, ha they had wine the first time. Then fast forward months later. Now the place is sort of a mess. There's pizzas everywhere. And now fast forward even months or like a year after that. There's flies and beer bottles and pizzas everywhere. And just garbage and cockroaches. Yeah, I gotta watch the bear. People keep telling me to watch. You guys kept telling me to watch that. I went to my mom's house like last week. And I uh, just to talk to her. And she was like, oh, you got to watch this new show. It's called The Bear. I was like, Jesus Christ. Everyone's been telling me to watch that. Um, all right. I've been going. <laughs> all right. Um, can I just play? Hey, dipshit. We're explaining. I, I, I'm explaining and a, a game all about story. So open your ears. Uh, he was worried about my kids. So then he brought them a bunch of books and toys. Okay. Um, I got contacted by the Child Welfare Center. I guess some nosy bitch or asshole in my building reported hearing a child crying at night in my place. The fuck do they know? 
He hasn't called me much lately. Am I destined to be alone? Everyone else is out enjoying life while I'm working my ass off raising kids. Why am I the fucking bad guy? If I hadn't had children, maybe I'd be planning my summer vacation with my friends right now. Nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? He hasn't called much lately. Wait, so she still locks him in the closet. Yeah, maybe they're just dead in there. But but aren't I I'm I'm one of the children, am I not? <sighs> Miss Krista Planert, we have reached out to you repeatedly but have yet to receive a response. We take this We take this to mean you have no intention of remedying the issue. You're in violation of German Civil Code Article 1631 Section 2, according to the federal court, has instructed us to take your children. Should you have any objections to this, please contact us as soon as possible. It is sleepy, yeah. Guess I'll check on that baby. Boy found dead in refrigerator, mother arrested. A boy was found dead today in a refrigerator in the home of his 41 year old mother, a person who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body. Person A claims to have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him. When she noticed he wasn't moving the next morning, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are conducting an autopsy to determine the cause of death. According to the investigation, a person's, person A's daughter ran to a neighbor's house to call the police to report her mother for neglect. When detectives arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrigerator and arrested her mother. You just me again! You can just stay in there! Game is subtle. those flies were in my room I was gonna say what the hell dude why am I seeing this room here in the villa I tried so hard to forget this place
We're growing up again. There's my brother. Sort of. Shit, lag! Look at Silent Hill, guys. See? It's like Silent Hill 3. Look at look the world's tearing apart. Look guys. This makes me want a Silent Hill 3 so bad, even though I have no faith in this IP anymore. I really like what you drew me way back. What was the picture? I couldn't even see. You're into art, right? Yeah. You could audit an art class. The FPS is dipping, boys. I'm gonna keep my eyes at this. I, I won't look at chat anymore then. I was distracted by chat. Hmm? Wait. What's that? Oh. You like what you see? So silent, Hilly. What are you hiding inside? We're so silent. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm silenting out of my hell right now. Holy shit! I'm silent. Oh God. The hell has hit the fan. All right, where are we? Anyone got a map? This is not the way, boys. Okay, we have to go the other way. for rope I expect to get rope yeah I was hoping this message would be short too it's a pretty long message Snorlax oh it's it's hoot hoot okay here we go this is new this is new new content new content there it is oh this isn't new fuck Did I scare you guys? Did you think I was gonna die? All right, all right, all right. Oh. Guys, keep it a stack with your boy Bakba Soup. Are you loving this game or what? Is it silenty enough for the Hell Club? Alright. I don't think this comes as a surprise, but I am lost as, a, as fuck right now. Alright, is there something in here? No. 
I don't know what way to go. Jesus Christ, dude. Can I keep my collectibles? I guess... It doesn't seem as bad as people are making out. Here's the thing. Let me ex I I'll explain at the end. Just splattering the name Silent Hill on something automatically means you have extremely big shoes to fill. Now, where this game this game is it's fine. Like I'm I'm enjoying myself. And it's a free game, so you can't be too too crazy on it. Um, but at the same time, like, you know, it's, it's nothing special. I really like what you drew me way back. I feel like I've played a thousand of these on Steam. You're into art, right? You could audit an art class. Like, it's fun. It's, it's a good game. But it's like, you know, it's not doing anything new for the genre or. Hmm? What's that? Oh. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. Crumble, grumble. No, Silent Hill could just happen anywhere. It's because of the Silent Hill phenomena. I see that town. I have no major qualms with that, but it's sort of just like... I don't feel like they did it to, to further the franchise at all. I just feel like they did it because they were lazy. Fuck, we can't make another game in Silent Hill. That's too, that's too hard. Can I go or am I dead? This part sucks. Like this part, this part, this part may ruin the game, honestly. Like. What are you hiding inside? open like okay a, a door is open I get that but where the fuck is it like, I get what we're doing by the way it's just find it find it no, the, the the aim is not like this. There's just a couple seconds. It's like Shattered Memories. This game is exactly like Shattered Memories in the sense that any like action part is just running away from a monster. Okay, I think that's the way, but I. Thank you, Karki. Please don't come in this door. All right, here we go. I hope we choose the right way. I don't think we did. This is new. 
You're way too hard on yourself. I guess it's just run to the end. Find it. Am I gonna be alone forever? Find it. February 21st. This year, Maya, 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 Maya's diary. I have been really absorbed in my work, but I decided to paint the girls who jumped off the villa roof. I'd like to think they left this place for something better. I think I might finally be free of my despair because I've never felt this inspired. I'm going to put every last bit of myself into this piece. March 4th. My roof piece is almost done. It might actually be my crowning achievement. But once this is done, then what? Do I have it in me to come up with something even better? How much longer can I enjoy the fame and praise I get now? Is there a despair and disappointment waiting for me right around the corner? The sadness that gripped me before has clawed its way back into my mind. I guess it was always there. Who knows how often it'll show up. The thought makes my skin crawl. Maybe I should just end things while I'm still happy. Go out on a good note. Wish I could talk to someone about all this. And she tried and we fucked it up. God, I am silent hilling so hard right now. March 13th, 2022. Approximately 1 p.m. on the 12th, popular graffiti artist CB Maya was found collapsed on the grounds of an apartment building in Kenton. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. The death of the 18-year-old girl comes as a shock to not only local community members, but also to all those who were familiar with her work. Authorities believe the cause of death may be suicide, but given her popularity and the lack of warning signs to her peers, they have not ruled out foul play, proceeding with a full-scale investigation. Wait. She killed herself half a year ago? Then that means... I've been here this whole time. What'll it take for you to forgive me? Please, end this. Someone might have killed Just her. let me die. Find it. Find it. Is this... inside of girls their impulses their urges what are you hiding inside don't worry about what people think be proud so she did notice me Be proud. She did notice us, guys. It was all for nothing. Let's get out of here. I was so happy when my mom liked the first picture I drew. All right, people. 
I could have had a different life. I'm just saying they should have called it the long message. Finally did love me. You actually noticed me. I never thought you would. Is that some of you guys in chat when I read your messages? Like Ali Mimo says, the boring message. Nice one. Uh, Stinky Winky, good boy, says, agreed. Libra says, yes. It sounds like Rose Winter's voice actress. Emily, what should I do? They should have called it Silent Hill Remake. <sighs> they should have called it Silent Sloppy. Anita, what's up? I'm sorry, Amelie. I was such a piece of shit. I had no idea she'd do that. What are you talking about? Did something happen? I thought I was invisible. That I didn't matter. No matter what anyone said, I didn't listen. Anita? But you and Maya... Both of you did see me. I should have figured that out sooner. Anita, wait. Where are you right now? Thank you, Amelie. You were always there for me. I'm... I'm going to go apologize to Maya now. Wait, Anita. Stop. Got a text. Oh? That's all it takes, guys. One message. I wasn't trying to be sarcastic, I, you know, it works. I've never played Life is Strange, but yeah, a lot of people are saying that. She's a, she got out of Silent Hill, the Silent Hill phenomena. They should have called it Silent Hill, the... Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The so like, was it good? don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. But I don't really mind. I just want someone to understand me. For those I love, and for those who love me, I want to keep moving forward and never look back James. to 18-year-old me. You made me happy. Um, was it good? Um, it was okay. It ain't breaking 
this ain't a new PT, if that's your question. <laughs> um, but this is the kind of game. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. If I look at this as a free game, a free random game on PS5 that's a horror game, it was good. Yeah, it was a good game. But if you're looking at this as a moving day, it feels kind of scary leaving my hometown. But I'll be 2022. Fine. I have my best friend with me. Five likes. Um. Like, this game makes sense in the Silent Hill universe because they're touching on uh, psychological trauma in a different way. Like, you know how the first three games deal with different themes of psychological trauma. This game also deals with that, but it's a little too, it's a little too on the fucking nose. <laughs> like, you know, there's no subtlety to it at all. Where one, two, and three are all about being subtle. And this is just like, everything is just on a fucking platter. You know, it, there's no subtlety to it. Um, so as a Silent Hill game, I mean, you know, this this could have been called anything. Um, I don't know why they chose to make it a Silent Hill game. Because um, it could have been anything. Uh, but what I what I do know is this is going to royally piss off Silent Hill fans. Um, because for all intents and purposes, this is what people would label a very woke game. And <laughs> it's good. Like, I can see it now when I wake up. The internet's blood is going to be fucking boiling for this game. Now, for me, I've played many games like this. It's nothing new. We've played a fuck ton of games that deal with psychological trauma and suicide, yada, yada, yada that have the same kind of pacing as this, the same kind of like my family was horrible to me, my friends hate me kind of thing. Oh wait, they don't hate me. You know, this has been done to death. This idea is extremely generic and it has been done many, 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 many times. So for Silent Hill to have a return with something that's very generic and like PT, PT, the last Silent Hill game was technically PT. Not really, it was just a demo. But this, is, this isn't this is a full game either. Um, and PT... PT fucking paved the road for thousands of games to come and still coming to this day! Like, P so Resident Evil 7 probably wouldn't exist without PT. Like, PT... did so much, good and bad, to the horror um, genre. This does nothing for the horror genre. This is like the most generic horror genre game. Like it's 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 like right up there. It, you can find hundreds of these on Steam, and they're all just as good or better. And there a lot are worse too. Um, yeah, it was fine though. Like it was fine. I'm not super pissed over it because I this is sort of my expectations. As you rewind to the start of the video, and someone says, "Do you think it'll be good?" and I laugh. As if, like, you know, a good Silent Hill game is basically impossible at this point. Well, no, I did like it, Jetfire. You tell yourself that. It's not like I was spamming through all the text and everything. The end sort of... The ending sequence was sort of bad, though, I gotta say. Jesus. Thank you, Poison. Thank you for all the follows, guys. And th needs a UFO ending, I agree. And thank you for all the subs, everyone. Thank you for all the... I'll probably put this on my main YouTube channel, because this is a Silent Hill game. Mm. This was really fun to stream, though. Like, this was great. I had a lot of fun. Stream-wise, it was fucking awesome. Like one of the better games I've streamed this year, honestly. It was uh, it was pretty fun. At first, I was taking it, trying to take it dead serious, but as soon as I seen those 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 red flags, I was like, all right, I gotta have fun with this game. Oh.
Oh! That was them.